wow totally blown away now some people might know where I am because uh, we've got this lighthouse half a lighthouse looking thing which is a, a bit of a monument to uh, Flinders Matthew Flinders but uh, I'm, at, I'm at Mount Lofty and uh, whew, it's a sight for sore eyes I tell you good elevation to overlook the city what do you think so there we have it it's going to lay down there but uh, the airport over in the distance here planes are coming in there you go looks like a bit of a bush got a bit of a fire a bit of a bush fire down here or a burn off it's um, very hot you really wouldn't want too much of a fire going off now there might be some burn offs another one down there and uh, we obviously got a, a tower up here which keeps an eye on things and some very big radio towers up there so yeah wow staggering right next little travel out of adelaide we've um just out of uh, hundorf come to this little place called berenberg and magic little spot sadly we've arrived on a day where um Strawberry picking is unavailable for some reason, um, but fortunately Jude, when she was here uh, December, January, she visited, so she will have some little photos, maybe some videos, she came out with the kids and uh, did a little family strawberry picking. However, there's still a fantastic um, museum uh, display, and of course you can get some of the, um, you can still get some of the produce here, some of the, um, the ice creams and um, jams and things. And interesting enough, the Berenberg, um, Jude's been feeding me this stuff, a nice little um, pickle or a relish or something. Now put two and two together, it comes from here. Anyway, let's go and check it out. So some interesting facts, sorry for the noise. We tend to call the whole strawberry fruit, but the tiny dots covering the surface seeds, but the seeds are actually fruit themselves. They hold single seeds inside a dry husk. These tiny fruits are called acnes. The number of acnes on each strawberry varies with strawberry size and variety, with the average being around 200. There are about 440 acnes on an Albion strawberry, which is grown here in Berenberg. So here's a little interesting one about Berenberg. The uh, mini jams marked a turning point for Berenberg. In the mid-1980s, South Australian Premier John Bannon lamented that Qantas was serving Scottish jam on international flights instead of good Australian jams like Berenberg. The fire was lit. Very interesting. All right, so here we have, for this little monkey over this side, and one over here, Ivy and Tilda, some strawberry pots. And we understand you can actually eat the pot. It's Belgium chocolate. Yeah. Yeah, you looking forward to it? Here we go. We're going to enjoy a nice strawberry pot. Drinking out the bottle, not thinking about tomorrow. Don't worry, that's a model. So we keep. Got your box? Yeah. You got your box? I'm a cabo in the sunburn tell Dorado. Don't worry, that's a motto. So we keep moving along. Ooh. So we keep moving along. Alright, we're out loose in Adelaide City. Yep. We caught the bus um, into the Adelaide city, which is a lot of fun. And uh, been walking around the town, found the Adelaide supermarkets. Yep, great um, variety of food, um, fresh vegetables, meat, yeah, so much to choose from. Yeah, lots. And of course, there was too much to choose from, we couldn't make a decision. So, next door to the uh, Adelaide Central Markets are the uh, Chinatown kind of things. So, uh, can't beat good old Chinese food or uh, Vietnamese or Japanese. Of Asian food here. Yep. It's really nice. So we're having that and then we'll venture into the city and see what's there. But uh, pop into this little corner here where it's a bit quieter and not so busy. Yep. So uh, we'll see as our adventure continues around the Lake City. See <laughs> Thank you. 
made it down the road a little bit further from the, uh, the central markets. Man, that was mad. Down here on uh, North Terrace, I think it is, uh, just opposite the convention centre, and I uh, found this wicked big building called a mod. It's part of the university, and it stands for the Muse Museum of Discovery. So there's uh, bunches of um, little interactive displays you can come and visit um, from time to time. So we'll have a little scoot around here and see what we can find. We're in Adelaide, the Mod Centre. It's a museum of discovery. And I've made an amazing discovery. Found a house. <laughs> it's a wicked interactive map, which we've discussed before with the, with the Earth. And yeah, how cool is that? Pretty up to date too. Into another display here. Give a, give a little flick of some of those um, planets here, my dear. This is obviously the discovery of space. Is that very Wow. Things you learn. Jude's, Jude's got it going now. She's found Lake Taupo. Well, I think she's probably going to look up her mum's house. Pretty cool. Look at that hands on. It's neat. Geez, you're a bit creaky. Move your arms around. A little bit scary that you're red. Another little thing I sort of found out, I've got to come and visit the library, the State Library here in Adelaide. They're already here. And uh, apparently it's, it's an oldie and a doozy. This bit's blocked off, but hopefully they'll be able to find something a little bit more accessible. What's your uh, interpretation of this lovely library? It reminds me of Hogwarts. Very, very quiet. It reminds me of Hogwarts. It does. <laughs> oh, what was that? Hogwarts? Hogwarts. It was um, Harry Potter. Harry Potter. <laughs> so what did you think of it? Pretty cool? Yeah, it's pretty cool. And very nice bit of architecture and um, lots of old books. Old, 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 old books. And you reckon, what's a movie? Harry Potter. Harry Potter, definitely. Looking for the old flying magical things. Mm. What a day to be out here. This is just. Come on, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, why do you keep doing that? Oh my, camera keeps flopping down. It's in landscape mode and then it goes flop. Maybe. Maybe your thing's getting flat. Right. How warm it is. It's at uh, the bottom. Uh, we're. Uh, Oscar? Adelaide Terrace, no. no. So Jude, in your very quiet voice, what do you think of the museum? I thought it was a library. <laughs> Ooh, <pie. laughs>